Well, it's that time again, time to start decorating for fall. And if you're like me, you want something that you can set up and, and leave up for a few months, not have to think about all the time because you're busy, you've got stuff to do. So I'm gonna show you how to decorate a fall tray, a tray that you could put on the island in your kitchen, you could put as a tablescape on your dining room table, and you can just leave it for fall and it's gonna look awesome. So trays can actually be tricky because what do you do to fill all this space and have it look good? So I'm gonna show you my favorite things to put in a tray. Um, and there are a couple different things that you need to consider and that is heights and colors. We want a variety of heights and a variety of colors. So I'm gonna show you what I like to do. Okay, so for my fall tray, I'm trying to put a few things that I can leave up for a couple of months. So I love, um, pedestals of different heights because they're great to put things on and decorate things with. I've got a lantern. This is actually quite a large lantern. You could go down in size if you wanted. I've got a nice fall candle, this lovely gorgeous candle. I've got some fall foliage. These are succulents but they've got some really nice fall colors. Works nicely with the candle. I've got of course a piece from the Darren Gigi Home Collection. These are obviously not only fall themed leaves, but also go really well with the whole color scheme. And then I always think you can throw in some neutral beads or something for kind of a good look. So let me show you how to put this together. And the great thing about a tray like this is that it's got neutral enough pieces that you can swap out things and make it a little bit more seasonal. So even though I've got a fall look going on, if I want even more fall or that more of that feeling of those falls, oranges and, and reds and things like that, I can swap out my picture. I'm gonna swap this out for our harvest truck, which is one of our best sellers. And I'm gonna swap out my fall foliage right here with um, a pumpkin. So now I've got this great tablescape once again, but it's got a little bit more of a fall hint to it. So this is my finished tray. There we go.